What does it take to transform a 600-acre wasteland into a beacon of innovation? That's the challenge facing Chicago South Works, where an ambitious proposal for a cutting-edge quantum computing hub might just redefine the city's future. Why quantum computing and why here? Quantum computing isn't just the next big thing in tech, it's the kind of innovation that can generate billions in economic activity, attract global talent, and create thousands of high-paying jobs. But how does Chicago South Works become the epicenter of this technological revolution? And what obstacles stand in the way of this grand vision? Welcome to Big Builds. Let's rewind the clock to the glory days of South Works. This massive steel mill was a cornerstone of Chicago's industrial might, churning out steel for everything from skyscrapers to ships. At its peak, it employed 20,000 workers, provided housing for thousands of families, and supported a vibrant local economy. This wasn't just a workplace, it was a lifeline for entire communities. Restaurants, shops, and schools, they all thrived around the mill, creating a bustling ecosystem fueled by steel. Workers could rely on stable incomes, and families could dream of brighter futures, all thanks to the steady hum of South Works steel production. But in the 1990s, the global economy shifted. Steel production moved overseas, and South Works couldn't compete. When the mill shut down, it wasn't just a factory that closed, it was the heart of the neighborhood. Families were left without income, businesses folded, and the area fell into economic despair. The collapse created a ripple effect that extended far beyond the workers. Schools lost funding, neighborhoods saw rising crime rates, and the once thriving community became a shadow of its former self. For decades, the site has sat idle, overgrown with weeds and rusting remains of what once was. But now, a new idea is sparking hope. Could Southworks finally rise again? Quantum computing is often called the next industrial revolution, and for good reason. Unlike traditional computers that rely on ones and zeros, quantum computers use qubits, which can exist in multiple states at once. This allows them to solve complex problems at speeds that would take traditional computers millions of years. Imagine the possibilities in healthcare. Quantum computing could accelerate the discovery of new drugs by simulating molecular interactions in days rather than years. For example, a quantum computer could help find the cure for diseases like Alzheimer's by modeling proteins in unprecedented detail. In finance, it could optimize global markets in real time, transforming the way money flows worldwide. Hedge funds, banks, and investment firms, they could all rely on quantum algorithms to make split-second decisions, maximizing returns and reducing risks. In transportation, logistics networks could become so efficient that companies save billions of dollars, all while reducing environmental waste. Picture a global supply chain where delays are eliminated, costs are slashed, and sustainability becomes the norm. Now, why Chicago? The city's central location, combined with its rich history in science and technology, it makes it a natural choice for such a hub. With renowned universities like the University of Chicago and Northwestern nearby, the talent pool is vast. Institutions like Argonne National Laboratory and Fermilab already position Chicago as a leader in cutting-edge research. Plus, Chicago already boasts a growing tech scene, making it ripe for quantum innovation. If Southworks does become a home to this hub, it could establish Chicago as a global leader in one of the most transformative technologies of our time. The plan for Southworks isn't just ambitious, it's groundbreaking. The proposed quantum computing hub would be a sprawling campus, designed to foster innovation and collaboration. It will feature state-of-the-art laboratories equipped with the latest technology to push the boundaries of quantum research. These labs, well, they could tackle problems as diverse as creating better batteries for electric vehicles to advancing artificial intelligence for healthcare. Office spaces will be designed to host everything from startups to established tech giants, encouraging collaboration across industries and ideas. Imagine a space where a local AI company collaborates with a global pharmaceutical firm to solve pressing issues like pandemics or climate change. The vision also includes residential zones where researchers, students, and tech professionals can live and work seamlessly. These neighborhoods, well, they'll be designed with sustainability in mind, using green building materials, solar panels, and smart technology to create a living space that reflects the cutting-edge nature of the hub itself. To ensure the site is welcoming and inclusive, green spaces and recreational areas will provide a balance of nature and innovation. 
Picture families enjoying newly landscaped parks, while professionals discuss breakthroughs over coffee at local cafes. Community engagement will also play a critical role, with dedicated spaces for workshops, events, and STEM education programs aimed at inspiring the next generation of innovators. This isn't just about building a tech hub, it's about creating a thriving ecosystem that serves both the global tech community and the local neighborhood. Imagine Southworks buzzing with activity, scientists working on groundbreaking research, startups pitching their ideas, and families enjoying the revitalized waterfront. Of course, no project of this scale comes without challenges. One of the biggest hurdles is environmental cleanup. Decades of steel production, they've left the site heavily contaminated. Addressing the soil and water pollution, that'll require meticulous planning, time, and significant financial investment. Without proper remediation, the site's potential cannot be fully realized. Funding is yet another critical challenge. While the project has sparked interest from private investors and government officials alike, the financial requirements, they're immense. A sustainable flow of investment that'll be necessary to bring this vision to life, requiring innovative funding strategies and public-private partnerships. Then there's the question of community trust. After decades of failed redevelopment proposals, local residents are understandably skeptical. Many, well, they worry that the benefits of this project might bypass the surrounding neighborhoods, favoring outside investors and elites instead. Winning over the community will require clear communication, transparency, and a commitment to shared success. Finally, the timeline also presents a challenge. Building such a hub isn't a short-term project. It could take years, even decades, for the vision to fully materialize. Maintaining momentum and interest over this time span will require ongoing effort and adaptability. If the quantum computing hub succeeds, the impact will ripple far beyond Southworks. Thousands of new jobs will be created, ranging from high-tech research roles to construction and service industry positions. This influx of employment opportunities, it'll breathe new life into the local economy, giving families a reason to hope again. Local businesses, they'll also benefit from the revitalization. Restaurants, cafes, and shops in the area could all see a surge in customers, thanks to the increased foot traffic generated by the hub. The presence of a thriving campus will inspire innovation, attracting startups and entrepreneurs eager to be a part of the action. Education will also play a significant role in this transformation. Partnerships with local schools and with universities will create new pathways for students to enter the tech industry. By integrating education into the hub's mission, Southworks will empower the next generation with the skills they need to succeed in a quantum-driven world. Beyond the economic and the educational benefits, the transformation of Southworks could serve as a model for other cities facing similar challenges. It shows that with the right vision, even the most neglected areas can be revitalized into thriving centers of opportunity. Zooming out, this project isn't just about Southworks or even Chicago. Quantum computing is poised to solve some of humanity's greatest challenges, from tackling climate change with advanced modeling to revolutionizing global healthcare. The possibilities, they're limitless. For Chicago, hosting this hub means taking a leadership role in shaping the future. The Southworks site could become a shining example of what's possible when innovation meets resilience. It's a chance to prove that even the most devastated areas can find new purpose with the right vision and investment. This project, it represents more than a comeback for one neighborhood. It's about rewriting the narrative of an entire city. One of the most exciting aspects of the Southworks Quantum Computing Hub is its potential to inspire the next generation of scientists, engineers, and tech leaders. By integrating education and community outreach into its mission, the hub could become a catalyst for STEM education in Chicago and beyond. Imagine local schools partnering with the hub to provide hands-on learning experiences, from coding workshops to quantum physics demonstrations. High school students could participate in internships, gaining real-world experience in cutting-edge research labs, colleges and universities. They could also establish satellite campuses at the hub, offering specialized programs in quantum computing and in advanced technologies. These initiatives wouldn't just benefit the local community, they could also address the national talent gap in technology. By sparking interest in STEM fields early and providing pathways to advanced careers, the hub could shape the future workforce while ensuring that Chicago remains at the forefront of global innovation. 
The story of Chicago Southworks is one of resilience and reinvention. While the challenges are real, the potential rewards are too great to ignore. A quantum computing hub, it could bring jobs, innovation, and hope to a community that has waited far too long for a comeback. So, what do you think? Could quantum computing be the key to saving Chicago South? Let us know in the comments below. And if you're as excited as we are about the future of this groundbreaking project, hit that like button and subscribe to Big Builds for more stories about transformative projects shaping our world. The future of Chicago might just start here, and you won't want to miss it.